How's everybody doing today? Alfred Flores, CEO, President, New Age Electric. I wanted to show everybody a quick demonstration on how to merge or combine multiple Acubit files into one job. And, and this comes in handy when you're bidding a job that's pretty big, you know, decent size, could be 10, 15, 20 plus million dollars and you want at least three or four estimators on it, you're more than likely going to split it up. You know, one might be doing all the distribution, the site, uh, site work. Um, one guy might be doing all the lighting in the inside. The other guy might be doing all the power. Uh, another guy might be doing all the low voltage. Um, depending on the building, how many systems there are, you, you, you highly recommend it. You probably do have about four or five jumping on that one. So, um, Let's get started. Let's show you how to do it. It's pretty simple. Uh, first, let's say you're the main guy and you're going to combine everybody's files together. So we'll start off with low voltage system. So we'll open this one up. We continue. Now, there is a button here called Merge. Click this button. Your screen will look like this. So you're able to grab the jobs that you want to merge together. So in this case, we want to merge the power building and the power site. Make sure these all are clicked because it's going to keep everything in the same system and categorize everything correctly. And so when this all merges, all the hours, everything assigned, everything is one complete job. Uh, before we do that, I'll hit exit really quick and show you that this is a low voltage system so I have nothing in here besides the systems so I have an intrusion detection I have an a phone I have clock intercom security CTTV and teledata everything else is blank uh, we go into the other ones I could show you that there is a power in all the building whoops go back in that one these are the power in the building so see the fixtures switches branch wiring devices HVAC feeders distribution grounding some fire alarm everything else is blank uh, power site that's all our exterior work uh, there is all the underground light pole bases fixtures there's probably some site power meter sockets and that's about it just double check nothing else is in here okay so you see there's nothing else in here so we're gonna open this up we're gonna call this our main file we click merge select the two jobs make sure all these are checked hit merge you're about to merge these two files into a current job you should, yes everything seemed to be successful you can come back and kinda of take a look at everything notes uh, it this pretty much tells you everything that it just did for all the jobs everything was successful it told you it merged your labor factoring, your temporary assemblies, your notes, designations, anything empty, merging takes off. Then it jumps to the second job and it tells you the same thing. Uh, it tells you everything was successful, there was no errors. Merge complete, update extension information successful. So we're going to hit exit. So now this is your main job. We go to the top and there's your fixtures now. Switches site lighting, site power, branch wiring, wiring, wiring devices, 
HVAC, T stats, distribution, feeders, your grounding, your fire alarm, teledata, your security. Everything is now located in one file. Now here's the thing you gotta remember when you are merging files, it does not carry over uh, subcontracts though. So if you got subcontractors, it will not carry this over. I don't know why, I have never figured out how to do that or even attempt to call Trimble, but it does not carry that over. It won't carry over general expenses. So you just gotta remember when you are doing this probably if you are the low voltage guy you do have to come in here and plug out your system in and maybe it might be beneficial for you to have this as the low voltage guy as your main file so you can have all those systems in there those are really important because you're gonna have probably like 10 subcontractors working versus if you're doing power inside some exterior work you're uh, only gonna have maybe an excavation company maybe a uh, maybe a crane guy too. Um, uh, so same thing with the power and lighting. You might have some fixtures and controls. That's simple enough. You can plug that in later. But the, I would say if you're doing low voltage, let that guy have the file, and then that way he can merge all your stuff in there, and then you can plug in the lighting and anything else in there as well later. Uh, once again, this is Alfred Flores, CEO, President, New Age Electric. Leave some comments, shoot me an email. Thank you for watching. Till next time.